The People's Democratic Party is embroiled in an internal squabble over the fate of its chairman, Uche Sekundas. There are members who want him to resign and, of course, others who want him to stay. With the division all too evident, Plus TV Africa's Jacinta Obuku brings us the views of two politicians, one of whom is a national executive of the PDP. The national chairman of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, is fighting the battle of his life. The party's caucus at the House of Representatives have advised him to resign in order to save the party from collapsing. According to a communique signed by Honorable Kinsley Chinda from River State, quote, we urge the chairman to consider making the necessary personal sacrifice worthy of a leader and the party's current and future interest, with a firm assurance of honorable regards and appreciation by the party leadership now and in years to come. This he would do by honorably resigning his position as party chairman immediately to allow the party an early start. End of quote. But a politician and former media advisor to the governor of River State, Upunabo Inko Taria, argues that the call for seconders removal is more personal than it is about leadership issues. It's simple because they believe that this man is not his they are probably October, November, or they're about. So why not just let it be? Then you now bring in that vibrant man that you believe that will take the party that will ensure victory of the PDP come 2023. You have just about you have more than a year to go. So why are you in a hurry? The Assistant National Publicity Secretary of the PDP, on the other hand, points out that interest and crisis cannot be wished away in politics. To the electorate, to the people outside, what is happening in both PDP and APC are normal things that are expected prior to a contest, which is 2023. On the argument that Uche Secondos isn't vibrant enough to lead the party through the 2023 general election, this is what Odeyemi has to say. It did not engage us enough. It did not give us the necessary recognition as national officers. We were not given any role, even though the constitution states that we are to deputize for the principal officers. But what we are saying is, a good administrator will still know how to engage people rather than just see them as I do. The governors elected on the platform of the PDP, the party's lawmakers, members of its board of trustees, the National Executive Committee and the National Working Committee are all weighing between seconders and the River State Governor Nason Wiki, who is considered more strategic to the party's future ahead of the 2023 elections. Jacinta Obuko for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.